Well, you join us today on the River Orn and uh, we're into a fish straight away. Don't know what it is. Fish in the far bank, it's probably a small skimmer, I think. Nice roach. Very nice roach. That was the uh, first cast of the day and uh, not been on this stretch of water for a long time and um, to be perfectly honest There he is. Well, that was a, a good start. Um, just got a little feeder on, some double maggot. I'm wondering if the... Uh, if the hook's a little bit far away from the uh, feeder, but uh, we'll try that again. So it didn't give much of a bite, that one. Fishing the far bank, we'll tighten up. And uh, see what happens. So quite a deep piece of water here and uh, very slow moving. Some um, quite a few years since uh, I fished here before. Um, last time we did um, there were a lot of cormorants about and um, uh, it was pretty hard going to be honest. So that's a very good start to get uh, a roach like that um, right at the start of the day. Nothing on that cast. Let's uh, see if anything's had a go at the bait. I'm a little bit concerned that uh, the hook link's too long. And uh, yeah, as I thought, the uh, bait's been hammered. So we're going to shorten the hook link because there's obviously fish there and uh, we can't see the bites. So it's looking good. change the old glasses. So that we can see what we're doing. Well, just had a bite. But, uh, If you can see that, but the uh, maggots have been well eaten. Oh, 
so we've got fish in the swim now. Since catching that first one, I've uh, come about halfway back because I had a couple of line bites, and um, I was getting fish taking the the bait on the far bank, but it, it's quite a long way over, and um, they were taking it, and the maggots were coming back, having been sucked to death, but there was getting no. Uh, no indication on the rod tip at all, so came back halfway and uh, first cast I had another roach, I didn't have the camera switched on, and that was the second cast, and um, we had a bite again, so I think there's plenty of fish about, um, but on the far bank I, uh, I just couldn't see the bites on the tip, so uh, trying a bit closer in and got one straight away uh, but I've also seen quite a bit of bubbling going on as well so and a fish roll a little bit closer in so uh, we've got the line clip on and if I miss the bite the dog will tell me anyway Another bite, and we're into a good fish this time. This, this, if this is a roach, it's a good one. Oh, I think it is a roach. It's, uh, I can see it under the water. It's, it's put another. Yeah. Oh, struggle. Let's uh, get the landing net ready. This is the sign of what the roach are like down here, then uh, I'll certainly be coming to have another go. Let's uh, see if we can get that one in the net. Oh, he's in. He's in. Rod down. Well played again by the decathlon landing net pole. What a cracking roach this is. Well, look at that. That's uh, got to be a good half a pound, not a bit more. There he is again. What a lovely fish. A bit of a tangle, as per always. You can see him as well, can't you, dog? Let's put him back in the net. Drop him in the water. That's the uh, third roach of about that size. Um, where we're fishing today um, is known as a parkour national. Um, so it's a bit of water that's open uh, to everyone with a rod license. Um, the River Orn uh, flows down through Carn. Um, and then out into the sea and we're about uh, uh, 10 kilometres from the centre of Khan or Khan as they call it here um, the river's still quite wide here even though we're uh, probably 30 kilometres or so from the sea and uh, the Orn stretches ooh, a good 50 or 60 miles inland so it's a, a fair sized river I wouldn't normally um, fish far out as I am, but uh, I brought with me today 
um, a Shimano uh, Forced Master rod, um, which is um, 12 foot, and it's very powerful and it's quite easy to uh, cast the, I suppose must be 50 meters I should think over towards the far bank. Just be nice to get a, a good sized bream or or something just uh, before we uh, we finish the video. Well that's all we've got time for today. Um, we finished off by having a little perch but hardly worth showing you. Um, but a lovely little spot. I think we'll come back and try here again. Perhaps bring Colin with me and uh, we'll see what we can catch. Um, much improved from the last time we came, about five, six years ago. Uh, no sign of any cormorants and um, there was fish about all day long, but uh, no bream. But three good roach, a little dace and a little perch to finish. So we'll be back again and um, hope you enjoyed it and uh, we'll see you on the next video. for now.